The overall goal of this procedure is to demonstrate methods of examining Drosophila motor, sensory, and coordination behaviors. This is accomplished by first assessing larva motor function using the crawling assay, assessing adult motor function using the ring assay, and assessing adult coordination and sensory abilities with the courtship assay. Ultimately, this panel of behavioral assays can show how genetic and external factors like drug treatments can influence activity and coordination in Drosophila. The main advantage of this assay over existing methods like negative geotaxis is that the ring assay is higher throughput and more sensitive. This method can help answer key questions in the neurodegenerative diseases field such as early stage detection of locomotor defects. Demonstrating this assay will be Dr. Jamie Becknell, a postdoc for my laboratory. The larval crawling assay is used to measure the effect of genetic and environmental factors on motility. To begin, set up a cross of 10 to 15 males and 10 to 15 virgins in a standard bottle. After 24 hours, healthy adults will have laid enough eggs to populate the bottle. To keep that population aged matched to 24 hours, clear the adults to a fresh bottle and repeat the process. Now, incubate the bottle until third instar larvae are observed in the food. To the bottle, add 50 to 100 milliliters of 20% sucrose and let it sit for 20 minutes. The larvae.